Just when we thought Mother Nature wasn't going to have a hand in the State A softball tournament anymore, about 10 minutes before the first pitch of the State A championship game between Billings Central and Columbia Falls, blue skies turned into a torrential downpour. This was the aftermath after about 30 minutes. And so with the fields completely unplayable, both teams got on their buses and made the trip over to Gallatin. The first pitch was thrown just after five and it was Columbia Falls from the start with a runner on second. Hayden Peters with the knock to left. Aline Johnson lays out for it but can't convert and Taylor Lingle scores. Next at that, Peters now looking to come home and Sid Mann says I got you going yard over the center field wall. Wildcats already up a quick three. Billing Central gets their turn and Brooke Thompson delivers with the base hit to left. Lydia Todd scores making it 3-1 after the first. But just when we thought we were in the clear, more delays at the bottom of two after nearby lightning. It didn't matter for the Rams though because the bats only got hotter with a near home run for Brooke Thompson to cut the Wildcats lead to one. But a three run inning in the fifth gave Columbia Falls all the cushion they needed to pull out an 8-2 win over Billing Central, clinching their first ever state championship. This team has been a family the last four years, and I knew that this was the team that could get it done. It's just, it's so exciting uh, to be Columbia Falls' first ever state champion team. I have no doubt that these girls will continue it into next season, and I'm just so grateful for my time and being able to play for Columbia Falls. Um, I don't know, it's just, it's so surreal. I just, I can't even describe how happy I am right now, and I, I wouldn't want to win with any other team or any other coach. In Bozeman, Ashley Washburn, MTN Sports.